Hello friends, how are you all, I hope you are all well. Chris Foster didn't behave well during 90 Day Fiancé, The Other Way Season 4. The franchise might not be the right fit for the fledgling reality star. Point 90 Day Fiancé, The Other Way Season 4 cast member Chris Foster behaved badly all season long, which should be enough to get her banned from the 90 Day Fiancé franchise. American woman Chris aired drama after drama in her relationship with Venezuelan woman Jamie Noguera, resulting in violence that led to a split. Now, there are grounds for her to be fired from the 90DF franchise, even though she participated in the finale. Currently, several cast members have been fired from the 90 Day Fiancé franchise, while others have been rumored to be let go. Jeffrey Paschal was fired after his violent assault and kidnapping of his former partner landed him in prison, with a sentence of nearly two decades. Meanwhile, recent cast member Alina Kozevnikova was fired during her season, after past racist and offensive posts resurfaced on the internet. Meanwhile, Lisa Hamm was rumored to get the axe from the 90 Day Fiancé franchise, after she used a racial slur against her ex, Usman Umar. While Chris hasn't been fired, she showed behavior that could lead to the boot. Hello everyone welcome to my channel. Please subscribe and keep watching for more details. 8. Chris lied all season on the other way. One of the reasons why 90 Day Fiancé fans are sick of Chris is because she spent the season lying. Chris came across as the queen of excuses on the other way season 4. She invented many reasons why she had to go back to the U.S., as well as why she had to stay there. First, Chris claimed that she had a necessary court date due to the theft of her rare motorcycle, and later invented another excuse for bailing on her wife. Chris then insisted that she had to stay in the U.S. for work, even though she'd planned to move to Colombia and start a job there. She later claimed it was because her son was arrested. Overall, the many lies of Chris established her as deeply untrustworthy. 7. Chris' behavior was consistently shady. In addition to her lies, Chris exhibited some shady behavior. She came up with a reason to go to the pharmacy right away in Colombia to pick up opioid medication. Then, she claimed she was unable to stay in Colombia because she couldn't get her narcolepsy medicine. Chris' narcolepsy plot line fell under suspicion as she seemed to use the illness as an excuse to ghost Jamie while they were dating. Meanwhile, Chris had a shady past, including her house mysteriously burning down. She didn't seem to receive insurance money for it. In general, she was known for her accidents and ailments. Chris has also been accused of drug use numerous times, though she recently denied these claims. 6. Chris Exaggerated Key Life Details Along with her shady past, Chris seemed to have a propensity for exaggeration, and she may enjoy shocking others. The wife of the other way season 4 cast member Jamie told many tall tales that could have been bids for attention. For example, Chris neglected to tell Jamie important things, such as how her house burned down and what was happening with her finances. She instead told Jamie to quit her job and promised to pay for their rent and lifestyle. Chris later tried to paint Jamie as a gold digger and user, when the latter woman asked for rent payments. Chris also concealed dramatic, and even dangerous, aspects of her character, until she met Jamie, for the first time. For example, she hid her love of knives. 5. Chris appeared to exaggerate her issues. Since Chris established herself as a liar, and exaggerated during The Other Way Season 4, it became difficult for viewers, and Jamie, to separate fact from fiction. When the women chatted for a year, Chris appeared to present herself as a healthy individual. However, she then revealed an array of serious medical issues, including a major neck problem. The seemingly very serious conditions shocked Jamie, as she'd heard nothing about them for the past year. Despite claiming that she was in debilitating pain, Chris took on numerous odd jobs that required manual labor. She also jumped into the pool in a way that slammed her neck. Her activities raised questions about her chronic pain claims. 4. Chris seemed to fake her feelings for Jamie. Chris then went on to seemingly fake her feelings for Jamie during The Other Way Season 4, much as Stephanie Motto had previously done with Erica Owens. 
It seemed clear that Jamie had real feelings for Chris and was deeply in love with her. However, Chris seemed more focused on herself than her relationship. Since Chris was later accused of cheating with her ex-husband in the U.S., it's been called into question if Chris is even attracted to women. Perhaps she simply wanted to live in Colombia. If Chris did have romantic feelings for Jamie, they appeared to fade quickly. 3. Chris gaslighted her partner, Jamie. While Chris established herself as a messy, lying, and untrustworthy 90-day fiancé franchise partner, she also took things a step further by doing some gaslighting. Chris told Jamie one thing and tried to get her and their fellow cast members to believe something different. Chris clearly told Jamie to quit her job and promised to support her for two years. However, she then let her mother know that she felt like a sugar mama who was being used. Jamie arrived at the tell-all with proof that Chris had never paid her more than a small amount of money in the first place. This revealed the depth of Chris' manipulation. 2. Chris assaulted her partner, Jamie. Chris went on to not just lie to Jamie, but to actually assault her. The other way season 4 finale saw Chris and Jamie getting in a relationship-ending argument after Jamie spoke loudly, and Chris freaked out. Producers told Jamie to get in the car with Chris so they could go home, which led to Chris putting her hands on Jamie. Chris forcefully shoved her. The duo revealed at the tell-all that they hadn't spoken since the incident, meaning that Chris hadn't apologized. She also didn't say sorry at the tell-all, as she appeared to think her actions were justified. In fact, Chris didn't even mention her shocking violence. 1. Chris took no responsibility for her actions. Despite mistreating Jamie all season, Chris displayed a disturbing lack of awareness at the season tell-all. The other way season 4 villain took no responsibility for her actions. Chris instead went on to use the same chillingly calm voice that she utilized in her interviews, but didn't use with her wife. She tried to paint Jamie in a negative light. Chris accused her former partner of numerous things, though Jamie came prepared with receipts, which earned her the support of 90-day fiancé franchise fans. They'd spent an entire season witnessing Chris mistreat the younger woman, time after time, 